Continuing coverage for you tonight after two weeks of community pushback, Antlers Park is officially off the table for a new sports stadium in downtown Colorado Springs. Developers say they have a new location, but that's all they're saying. So what is next? News 5's Lena Halland live from downtown Colorado Springs with what she knows. Lena. Well, despite the secrecy, developers insist this new plan will be a shot in the arm that downtown Colorado Springs needs, and they say it could generate millions of additional revenue every year. We've said all along, if you've got a better location, we will embrace it. Well, we think that they indeed do have a better location. In a last minute decision, plans scrapped for a sports stadium in Antlers Park. The Antlers Park proposal was a last resort and uh, nobody really wanted it to be there in particular because of its size constraint and, and also traffic and parking issues and legal issues. So. Although developer Perry Sanders maintains this project is legal, the community has been pushing back on the plan for two weeks now. City Council President Richard Scorman says he received at least 500 emails alone of people objecting to it. You don't want to kill the good for the perfect. Was Antlers Park perfect? Absolutely not. I'd be the first person to admit it's, it wasn't perfect. Um, but was it better than nothing? And the answer to that is, of course it was, because the park is in uh, tough conditions. Scoreman called the developers over the weekend to say they had found a much better location for the stadium, but couldn't tell us where. So to clarify, the point of calling all of us out here today is to say that Antlers Park is off the table, and to say that you have a second location, but also to say that you're not ready to tell any of us where that location is. Um, it's not my right to do that it really it lies with the city he told me the city needs to do their due diligence first to make sure it can be done and he insists the 15 million dollar price tag for the sports complex wouldn't take any money out of taxpayers pockets rather grant money from the state for the city for champions project we're going to end up saving the C4C money. The city has until the end of this year to use the C4C money or lose it. And Scorman says it will be another month or so until they are ready to release the new proposed location of that stadium. Now developers are also hoping to open the door to starting the discussion of building a convention center here in the Springs as well. Watching out for you in Colorado Springs, Lena Howland, News 5.